All right, welcome everybody. We are gonna take a walking field trip today down to Westchester Lagoon, okay? And so we should have four groups walking today. The Indigenous Ed Program has a theme of birds and biomes, and so one of the ways that we're providing the cultural enrichment is to take the kiddos down to Westchester and have them observe the birds and the biomes that are down there. We have been walking for like, probably like a mile, and we're trying to discover and identify different types of birds. Right now, like our group is trying to get more than the teacher, and there's a lot like that. And I have like a lot. And the great thing about this particular field trip is it matches up with our theme really well, and they get to see all kinds of birds. Like the Arctic terns are still here, which there's a lot of kids. I had never seen a turn before we came down to this field trip in person. I'd only seen like pictures and stuff of them. And so they've been hearing all of these stories and learning about cultural ties to these birds. In one of our language classes, they've actually been plucking a bird that will probably be butchered and given to elders. Um, and so they are getting to see all these birds in person. When we were at the observation deck and we were we were looking at birds and there was a bird that went under the water for like two minutes. It's a lot of fun to come out and see the birds. Our kids don't really think to identify birds when they're in their neighborhoods. Um, so bringing this into an educational setting um, and having them identify the birds in their area is important to them. It helps them understand the fragility of nature and what it means to live in an urban setting while still using indigenous and rural knowledge. I really like, I've done this summer camp since I was like in kindergarten and we go on field trips every year and it's really fun to learn more about because we learn like a different like lesson each time and it's really fun and even in the classrooms it's fun because we're always doing something like not boring. One of the things that is very important to me is that we're giving kids an opportunity to make connections with being scientists and mathematicians in a different context because we as Indigenous people have been scientists and mathematicians since time immemorial. It just doesn't look like what it does in a regular classroom. So that's one of the big things about this program is it gives us a chance to get those connections and have them see those things from a different perspective and hopefully that will help them be successful in the classroom setting during the regular year. As Indigenous people, we are the stewards of this land uh, and they get to take the knowledge that they learn here in the Summer Enrichment Program and bring it back into their schools. Um, not only the social emotional learning pieces of being a good human being and growing up um, to be a good human being, but they get to take the Indigenous knowledge of whatever theme we have for that year and bring it back to their communities. So they'll be able to go back uh, during the school year and say, no, that's not just a seagull, that's a mugal. Or no, that's not just a swan, that's a tundra swan. Because you get to go outside and you get to learn about different animals each year.